Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. My name is Kimberly and today I'm going to be showing you guys how to make these Mother Day vases. Um, they're made out of picture frames, just a little spin on presenting mom with flowers this year. Um, I thought it was just cute. I saw it on Pinterest and I was like, hey, let me try it. I guess I might as well give y'all a tutorial on it. Anyway, if you're ready, let's get started. All right, let's go over the materials that are needed real quick. You're gonna need some picture frames. I have to do three of them, so I have a total of 12 picture frames. Of course, you're gonna need some pictures, and I have some poems in here as well that I'm gonna put. I'm gonna put three side, um, three side pictures, or well, three parts of the pictures, and then a poem on the other side. You're gonna need a glue gun and some sticks. Uh, of course, the floral arrangements, whatever you want of your choice. And then you're gonna need um, some type of backing for the bottom. I just cut some styrofoam, um, a backboard or something I think I got from Hobby Lobby, I'll tag it. Some scissors, some tape, some floral foam if you wanna put it in the bottom. But I've noticed with the flowers that I have, it um, doesn't really need it, but I'll show you. And then I made some um, Happy Mother Day picks. I made two kind that says Happy Mother's Day and best mom ever and then you're gonna need some um tissue paper if you want to put it on the um, bottom to wrap it to make it a little neater with that floral foam anyway that's it all right first we're gonna take the picture frame and put, actually put a picture in and this is a picture of me from my mom for her mother's day one that i'm making for her And you're gonna just keep doing the same thing for all four sides. And like I said, I'm actually putting a poem on one side of it and pictures on all the other three sides. And you're gonna just tear it off and you're complete for the other two sides. All right, so I made, if any of y'all are interested, I made three um, different types of poems that are uh, available for digital print. I have the grandma one. This one is all the same for, the, for my mother. She's on different backgrounds. And this one. All right, so next we're gonna take all four of the frames and we're gonna hot glue them together to make the vase. Then we're gonna take this and you're gonna lock it down as such, making sure all the sides are even. You're gonna have to hold it in place. For a few seconds. And then we're gonna move over and do the same thing on this side. The other side as such. Hold it down. Lock it in place. Make sure the edges are even. Hold it to firm in place as such. have dried, we're going to come back and put the final top on, which we're going to take the glue gun and just glue it here on this side first, and you need to work quick and make sure you have plenty of glue in your gun. Take the one side, put it on here, matching it, making sure it's even, and then you want to press it down. 
hold it till it's in, it dried in place. And now we're gonna turn it around and now we're gonna glue the final side right here. Again, make sure you have plenty of glue in your gun because this is gonna move real fast. Okay, while that's drying, we're gonna take the bot, the backing that we're gonna put on the back of this, and we're gonna put some tissue paper. I have some Valentine's Day leftover tissue paper, and we're gonna just cover it so it can be neater for the bottom. So we're gonna just put it here, cut a piece, and then just tape it around and then glue the bottom. All right now that that's cut. All right, now that it's cut, we're gonna take some tape and tape it so we can get the um, bottom to hold. And then we're gonna hot glue the bottom on. We're gonna take this, this is the right side. We're gonna flip it bottom side up. And then we're gonna take our backing. We're gonna take some glue. And the camera shape and take some glue. And just glue it all around. So you got the corners good. Make sure it's bottom side up. And we're gonna just put it like such. Hold it till it's dry. Next, that. All right, next you're gonna take some floral foam and you're gonna measure it to cut it so it can fit down in here. My flowers fit perfectly, but I'm just gonna do it without having to cut it. But I'm just gonna do a demonstration just in case if you wanna have a floral foam for it in the bottom of your basket, in the bottom of your vase, rather. And you just take it and you're gonna measure it like right where it is and come over just a little bit. And make sure you just want to cut down on it. Scissors work perfect. Just go down on it like this. And then we're going to do the other side. Boom. And you're going to just drop it down like an as such. And there you go. Here comes the part where you can decorate it however you like. I'm just gonna take my flowers. Like I said, my like ones that I got from Hobby Lobby, they actually got fifty percent off. They fit perfect once I fold them, like right in here, and then I just drop them in there. I like the height and everything, but you can just do whatever you want. Just gonna take it, fold it at the base, like this. We're gonna just drop it back on in there like this. And there we go. Alright, so I'm gonna drop a piece of foil foam in the inside here because I want my pick to hold up. So I'm just gonna drop, hope you can see it, and drop it right here. And then I'm gonna take the pick and then I'm gonna put it in there so it can stand up a little higher. So we're gonna take the pick and we're gonna drop it in the floor frame right here. Push it all the way in so it can stand up as such. And we're gonna to test it off a little bit and then we're gonna flip it around. And that is it. And there you have it, your Mother's Day picture base. Or Mother's Day, yeah, picture race. All right, you guys, and that is it. Uh, thank you so much for hanging out with me. And if you have any questions or if you have any suggestions for future content, 
please leave it in the comments section. Um, that is it. Thank you very much. And y'all, uh, please don't forget to like, subscribe, and to share this video as well. And y'all have a happy Mother's Day.